The final part to finding your why is you have to pay the price to get the nice. There is a price. People say, oh, I want to live like a millionaire. Well, the question is, do you want to live like a millionaire or do you want to be a millionaire? Like I said, no, no, I want to be a millionaire. Well, I can promise you one thing. To be a millionaire, you will work yourself almost to death to keep your millions. You will, because that's what you have to do in order to be a millionaire. If you want to live like a millionaire, where do you think a millionaire gets the time to go on fancy holidays and gets the time to go drive their sports cars or gets the time to spend time in their beautiful house? Seriously? You have to make, be more than a millionaire to be able to live like a millionaire where you can take weeks off and you can just carry on making money. There is a massive price to pay, whatever position. In every single vocation, every single thing in life that you do, there's a thing that they call the dip. You can correct me on this, but if I understand when you become a doctor, the first year is pretty much cool. The second year, I think it's organic chemistry. And there's this massive, massive book that you have to spend time learning to be able to pass the next phase. And it is a massive price to pay. And the people who make it on the other side, they understand the dip. You look at a guy who's a brilliant BMX rider on a bicycle. Find out how many times he has fallen and how many bones he has broken in order to be the best BMX guy. The guy who does the skateboarding, ask him how many times he's had to fall off, go to hospital, be repaired to get back on the board. You know those backyard mechanics? Those garage mechanics? There's a massive dip for you to go from your garage into a building where you've got to get premises. You've got to be able to keep those premises. You're going to have to employ more staff. There's a massive dip you have to go through in order to move. And if you're prepared to pay that price, you will get the nice. But whatever you put in, you're going to get out. If you're not appreciating what you're getting out, you need to change what you're putting in. Does that make sense? If you don't like it, it's the time of your choosing. We don't choose some of our circumstances, but you can choose what you're going to do with it and how you're going to come out on the other side. Is that making sense? So the final step in now being successful and following the rules and the laws that govern in finding your why is you have to pay the price if you want to get the nice the power of his dream brings you here his man sean carlard